Should you do a home inspection if you are selling your home prior to putting it on the market? I know there's so much to think about when selling and it's hard to decipher what to do or what not to do. In this video, I'm going to tell you why a pre-inspection is a really good idea. Hi, I'm Lindsay Carlisle with the Tom Daves EXP Realty team in Rockland, California. And we help homeowners sell their homes faster for more money and with less stress so they can move on to the next adventure in their lives. Now that you've spent time preparing your home for sale, why should you worry about a home inspection? I'll tell you why. The home inspection is just as important as your contract offer. Almost any buyer who is in contract will want to do their own inspection, and their agent will recommend that they get one. The home inspection is designed to evaluate the general condition of your home and all of its mechanical systems. This inspection can either make or break your deal, so spending a little time on some of these issues before your home gets under contract will save you time and money in the end. Also, knowing what repairs may come up and the cost to fix them will help give you a better understanding of what your true proceeds will be. Let's look at the major issues that often come up on a home inspection. Number one, electrical issues. Make sure that all outlets, GFCIs, and switches work and replace any broken outlet covers. Also, replace any burnt out light bulbs. We want to do this to avoid any negative observation on the home inspection report, such as light is inoperable. This may suggest that there is an electrical problem. Number two, water and plumbing. Make sure you don't have any leaky faucets or signs of leaks under your cabinets in the kitchen or bathrooms. Number three, your HVAC system. Make sure you clean out or replace any dirty air filters. They should fit securely. Number four, test your smoke and carbon monoxide detectors and replace any dead batteries. Number five, attend to broken or missing items. This can include doorknobs, locks, latches, window panes, screens, gutters, roof tiles, downspouts, and chimney caps. Number six, section one or two items on a termite report, such as dry rot. Dry rot often occurs around door frames, on exterior doors, or on the siding of homes. Now this is fairly common and for the most part can be easily addressed. Number seven, doors. Make sure that all of your doors open and close and lock easily. Garage doors must also have working safety features such as sensors. And last, Number eight, recaulk around tubs, showers, and countertops in both bathrooms and kitchen. Checking these areas before your home inspection is an investment in selling your property. Your real estate agent will thank you. Now, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach us at 855-TOM-DAVES. We're here for you.